back everyone today let us see a classic case of semi lobar hollow prosencephaly which was detected on an antenatal ultrasound uh, this case was contributed by dr n v k sandeep who is a good friend of mine so let us see the classic case a 23 year old pregnant lady came for anomaly scan let us see the usg features this is the axial section of ultrasound of fetal brain you can see the classic bilateral thalami which are partially fused here and you can see the ventricle is single which is called as monoventricle the similar thing lower down showing the single ventricle and deficient posterior falls you can see the falls is also irregular it's not smooth and straight and there is a deficiency of posterior falls and one more important sign in hollow prosencephaly which we need to remember is the snake under the skull sign which is nothing but the anterior cerebral artery courses just beneath the skull instead of coursing around the corpus callosum anterior and around the corpus callosum this is because the of the fused brain parenchyma the aca courses along the anterior aspect of brain beneath the skull which is called as snake under the skull sign always we need to apply doppler and see for the course of anterior cerebral artery and few more findings which is always associated with in hollow prosencephaly is the facial anomalies always look for the nasal bridge nasal bone cleft lip cleft palate and the lips so always look here you can see the lower lip is fine whereas the upper lip in the mid, in the midline this is the mid sagittal plane you can see there is a deficiency and you can see the nasal bone which is not even having a small nasal bone there is a depressed nasal bridge as well and you can see the similar large cleft lip in the midline because of absent philtrum you can see the defect in the axial plane the same thing which is shown better here and based on the findings on imaging the child was the fetus was brachycephalic rounded contour head with crescent shaped monoventricle and surrounding brain mantle there are fused frontal lobes which i have already shown rudimentary falls is noted posteriorly and partially fused thalami and we we did not see any corpus callosum or cavum septum pellucidum which is completely absent and azygous aca we, we we were able to see only single anterior cerebral artery beneath the skull which we call it as snake under the skull sign and face we have seen depressed nasal bridge midline cleft lip with absent philtrum and there was also associated single umbilical artery in this patient which was not shown in the images and we always mention we need to mention in the report about the prognosis of the condition in utero demise and stillbirth are very common with this condition and live born infants rarely survive beyond the first year of life so all these features are classic of semi lobar hollow prosencephaly let us see the classic features and few pearls about it incomplete forebrain division usually the forebrain develops from the prosencephalon that is this is it, there is a defect in the forebrain formation it is of intermediate in severity septum pellucidum is completely absent single ventricle is present absent anterior or posterior falls partial or complete thalamic fusion might be present sometimes there might be a complete fusion of thalamus sometimes it might be partial fusion and snake under the skull sign which i have already shown is very important in differentiating lobar hollow prosencephaly from septo optic dysplasia whereas in lobar hollow prosencephaly this sign is present whereas in septo optic dysplasia we don't see such sign and always most of the times these hollow prosencephaly spectrum is associated with mild facial or mild to severe facial anomalies like cleft lip and or hypertelorism so this is the entire spectrum of hollow prosencephaly that is the normal brain and here you can see the low bar hollow prosencephaly which is a mild variant and a low bar prosencephaly is the severe variant of hollow prosencephaly and what we have seen today is the semi lobar hollow prosencephaly thank you all